Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the walk around video of this Ford Fiesta ZTEC S 1.6 TDCI diesel manual. As you can see registered on 59 registration. Registered in 2009. It's covered just 117,291 miles from you. It has a road tax fee of just £20 per year and it's my job as Alex, the owner of Small Cars Direct, to present this metallic vision blue Fiesta to you in a full and comprehensive way, and picking out all of its uh, imperfections that are noticeable, features and benefits naturally, and uh, trying to give you a complete view of the car's aesthetical condition inside and out. Going to take a look down the side, both sides, front, rear, bonnet. Uh, going to look in the boot, look inside the car. I'm also going to start it just so you can see that it starts fine. No warning lights on the dashboard or anything untoward. So here we go, it's got a uh, great service history record, full service history, recorded services, 11 recorded services in the service book, including the all-important Canbuck change uh, at 94,000 miles carried out at Ford in 2017. It's got MOT through to July 2021. As you can see, the Vision Blue paintwork is extremely bright and in nice order. You can uh, achieve up to 78 miles per gallon on the extra urban cycle. Um, that may be not actually uh, too difficult to achieve. You'll be able to get close to it. I got over 70 miles per gallon on a drive from Lindhurst down to New Milton. Absolutely ridiculous miles per gallon. So it's super good on fuel. As you can see, it's nice and straight down the offside. As we look at the rear, take a close look at the rear. That's in nice condition. There's no large scratches or dents, scuffs to make you aware of. Nice and presentable for the age. Please remember this car is over 10 years of age. And uh, rear windscreen looking nice and clean. Roof spoiler looking good. Sunlight bouncing off that beautifully. Roof's in nice condition as well. As you look down the near side, it's nice and presentable. Zoom in on the wheels, we'll start off with the near side rear wheel. We'll, we'll find some markings to the edges of the wheels, but it's to be expected to be honest with you. We've got loads of tread on this tyre, absolutely bucket loads of tread, that looks virtually brand new. Yeah, this bumper on the corner, ever so slightly, just loose, I'm sure it wouldn't take much to get it back in line, but it's just to make you aware of, it's probably lost its fixing there. It's probably the worst marks really as we walk around so far and if we move down the side of the vehicle see if we've done that side profile nice and straight no large dents that jump out at you at all nice nice and clean wing mirror casing that's in nice shape looking good and if you zoom in on this wheel again you'll find the odd mark to the wheel this uh, Falcon branded tyre again virtually brand new got loads of tread hardly been used it would seem as you zoom in on the front end of the car, headlights crystal clear, no moisture or cracking to report to those lights. Front fog lights fitted as well. Bonnet wise, you're going to find the odd stone chip, I think it's to be expected. And we do have, there's a dent just there. As you can see, nice sunlight helping us out. Nice, fresh, brand new board badge fitted recently there. Looking fantastic, really finishing off the bright look of the car. And there you go. Let's zoom around onto this wheel just so you can see it. And uh, I think this tyre was advised. It's wearing a little bit more on the outer edge, but still got a fair bit of tread remaining there, I must say. There you go. We look to this uh, last wheel now, just zooming in on the wheels for you. There you go. Nice order, really. Quite a good wheel, that one. And we've got a Dunlop 
premium tyre here. Again, that looks, uh, I still see the manufactured markings, purple markings on the tread. So yeah, not old at all, you'd assume. Um, other markings down here, very hard to pick any out. It's nice and presentable. Let's take a look inside the car now. Seats. I think there was a mark on this seat here. And also a small one here. Got some just general wear to the seat there. Bolsters in quite good shape. No real markings to note there. And the passenger seat looking very good indeed. Take a look in the rear now. Slide that seat forward with no issues. And uh, in the rear, super clean in the rear. Apologies if the light is causing havoc with the video. I'm trying to nip out into the shade as much as I can. Isofix in the rear there. Sound system is really good for what is just a standard system. And uh, this car comes with automatic lights and electric mirrors as well. I'll start the car and I'll operate the windows and the mirrors for you and the radio system just so you can see that everything works. And now I'll jump into the boot for you. We've got electrically, sorry, not electrically adjustable, but we've got a height manually adjustable um, driver's seat. So you can jack your seat higher or lower if you're the driver, which is nice. Big boot area, it does go down quite far. So you've actually got a reasonable sized boot and you've got your tire compressor and sealant and jack and towing eye in there as well. It's all looking good. Parcel shelf present with the vehicle. And there we go. Take a look in from the passenger side. Again, zoom in on the seats, nice and clean. Do have a mark here to report on the passenger side. And you've got auxiliary input as well, for connecting any devices. Nice and presentable door card on the passenger front side. You've got your AC, so we'll run that up. We'll see if that's getting cold as well. When I start the car, multi-function trip, computer and you've got your audio controls on the left hand side of the steering wheel as well power outlet for charging any devices that you may have down next to the auxiliary input and uh, what I'll do now is I'll jump in the, uh, the cockpit and fire it up let's see it should start absolutely fine with no issues 117,291 miles from you there we go. As I say, it's been serviced 11 times, including Kembelt change, and its most recent service was carried out less than 100 miles ago, and the most recent MOT that runs to July 2021 was carried out just 26 miles ago. So we'll run up the AC, see if that's going to get nice and cold for us. Windows. Mirrors. There you go. Window on that side. All operational. That's nice to see. AC. Get it on face. Yeah, it is. Going to be cold. Uh, insurance group. So it should be extremely reasonable to insure. And that aircon is getting cold. Great news. Turn that off and uh, stereo. Avoid jailing circulation of the display or ruthlessly. All good. And uh, this car is just £20 a year to tax. So really affordable on the tax. And it comes sporting the 16 inch alloys. If you do decide to come and buy this vehicle today, tomorrow, you're more than likely it's going to have just under half a tank of diesel which is good. God knows how far that'll get you based on 60 miles per gallon. Quite far, you would assume. Anyway, please do check out my reviews. I've got over 175 five-star reviews online, Auto Trader, Google, Facebook, and our website. I'm immensely proud of those reviews. And we've been rated by Auto Trader 
highly rated for three years in a row and we are a trading standards approved quite with confidence Hampshire County Council business as well. We accept finance and we offer finance sorry so please do get in touch if you're interested in getting a finance quote and um, we'll send you a link for you to apply in your own time. We, uh, we do part exchange and uh, let us know what car you've got and the details and we also offer nationwide delivery so you can actually have this car delivered to your door. Anyway, I hope this video has been of use. My name is Alex of Small Cars Direct. Viewings are available by appointment. We're in New Milton, Hampshire. Please do get in touch, WhatsApp us, email us, call us and hopefully I'll speak to some of you soon.